It's an exciting time to be part of an organization that's wanting and recognizing that they need to make this type of change. I couldn't think of a better place to be. There's the, the, the quantitative evidence. We see it in our survey results, but really what's, what's exciting to me is you see it in, in the attitudes and, um, and the smiles and the, just the change in, in heart and spirit of people really feeling like um, there's a very positive momentum that's taking place right now. I have noticed uh, some of the like interactions that I'll hear with like some of the um, food service techs with the patients, it's gotten a lot better since I've been here. It, it used to be like, they would walk into a room and be like, are you done with this? This food, you know, are you done with this? And they just go, and now it's like, you know, hello sir, they'll say their name. Hello, how you doing? Are you finished with your meals? Is there anything else I can do for you? I've, I've been listening for that. I hear that a lot, it's just really cool to see. People are looking at their jobs differently. It's no longer just a job, it's no longer, um, that, that I'm confined to what my job description is, but I'm, I'm part of a bigger process now. And, and it just, it makes you look at what you're doing differently, that I can, there's, if I think of an idea of how I can improve patient care or efficiency for the health system or uh, just something that maybe no, nobody's thought of, that I'm now feel empowered that I can bring this out to my direct supervisors or somebody else in the organization to say, hey, why don't we try this? I'm seeing some changes in, in, our, in our employees, really, in, in, in making sure that um, they're very centered on patient care. They're centered on making sure that we're really working together as a team and taking care of each other. Um, I see them looking at our communities and, and making sure that we're engaged in our communities and making sure that we're taking care of our communities more, um, getting involved in different activities outside in the communities. Um, I'm, just, I'm just so excited about things that are rolling out with our new values. For me personally, this has really reignited my excitement as um, being somebody involved in healthcare. Um, I feel like I am able to push this forward to my staff that the patient experience is the foremost thing we need to be thinking about. It is all about the patient and what we can give to them and still mind our business aspect of things, but really keeping that as our focus, I think we can't go wrong. To be able to get the word out or spread about this new cultural change, you know, this is what we are doing even in the, the team that I'm on, is, you know, we are getting the word out by, you know, uh, email. and One-on-one -on -one is to me has been the best thing yet, is just walking up to different people all over the hospital and asking them about the new, how they heard about the culture change have they heard about the new uh, values? And, and to me, it's, it's, it's really spread because everybody is actually getting the word out. I mean, it's, it's spread like wildfire. Where I see this going and, and how I see it helping is um, the excitement is fantastic. And I think the excitement speaks for itself that there's something really awesome going on here. Um, awesome in scale and awesome in goal. Um, I'm really proud of um, our superiors and what they're doing, the fact that they're how they're supporting us and speaking to, you know, like they're speaking to my director about it, helping me out with that. Um, just how intricate it is um, and relationship involved it is, is very big turn on for me. People are going to dread the weekends because they love their job. They love the work that they're doing. They love their interactions. And so a Friday is going to be like a Monday. Um, because they don't want to go home, they want to continue the good work that they're doing throughout the week. It's just been an outstanding uh, couple of months, and that's what's so amazing. This has only been about two months that we've been into this process. What I would tell the, the Board of Trustees about culture change is that um, uh, whether they know it or not, um, this is one of the most powerful decisions that they've made in terms of um, supporting and in terms of um, uh, really enabling this whole process and project to take place. Um, it will be um, the keystone, um, the keystone uh, or what really defines Cone Health for, for, the, for the future.